Chief Executive Carrie Lam has defended the adjustment of policies to fight COVID. This came as the government moved forward with closed-loop arrangements for care homes without outbreaks in an attempt to keep the virus out. Johanna Chan reports. Joining the chief executive's daily briefing today, Welfare Minister La Chi Kuang said containers are being refitted to accommodate staff from care homes for the elderly which have not been infected by COVID. As part of the closed-loop system to contain the virus, the staff are encouraged to stay away from their own residences. Apart from the containers, they can move into hotels and travel to their workplace in designated vehicles. The plan faces a challenge, as some staff also have to take care of their own families. The government aims to give all elderly residents in care homes at least one jab by the end of next week. But law says some families oppose the plan. As the fight against COVID shifts to vaccinating the elderly and lowering the death rate, there's speculation whether a plan for citywide tests will go ahead. But the chief executive denied making a U-turn in its strategy. It has outgrown the normal capacity of the Hong Kong ASEAN government, or actually outgrown the capacity of Hong Kong. Any adjustment in policies or in practices uh, are to enable Hong Kong could cope with the situation as best as we could, could enable us to protect the public hospital system, but at the same time also to save lives. When asked whether the government had leaked information about mass testing to gauge public reaction, Lam said people should stop accusing her ministers, but admitted there were leaks that could not be traced. Johanna Chan, HKIBC.